everybody welcome back to my vlog it's a monday morning so happy monday but when you guys are watching this it's probably not um but for me it is so it's a great monday so far this is my second moving vlog this week i'm not physically moving but i'm like prepping to move so we're gonna go shopping for a lot of decor things i actually have to paint a couple of things and get crafty i am never crafty so this will be uh different for me and an experience to say the least i also have a wedding on friday so we'll get ready for that together um stride is doing an oktoberfest this upcoming weekend so i have to go shop for little decorations for that for fall set up the studio we're having a bar crawl on saturday so i might continue the vlog into the saturday for the bar crawl for stride so it's going to be a really fun vlog and i'm really looking forward to it and i'm really excited um but yeah it's a monday morning i just went for a run which is why i look disheveled um i did six miles today it was an awesome run it felt really really good um, and then I went grocery shopping for a couple of things and now it's nine o'clock. So, um, I'm kind of feeling like I gotta get on with my day today. Today's like, I gave myself a pretty easy Monday. Um, and then tomorrow I'm just doing like a lot more stride stuff and I teach tomorrow night as well. So this is just gonna be a really good vlog, but this is a really long intro. So, um, I'm at my parents' house right now. My parents are at the beach this whole week. So I, I posted on my Instagram story last night, like a Sunday reset of like what I was planning for the week. So I posted like what book I was listening to, what workouts I was doing this week, and what meals I had planned. And you guys loved it. So I think I'm going to do that every Sunday. So I just took a quick body shower. Obviously not my hair because my hair is a mess. But I do need to kind of like fix myself because I have a video podcast interview today. And they want to take like clips of it to promote it. The brand that i'm like doing this interview with so i need to look a little bit better but that's at 1 30 it's 9 30 i have time is going on my iPad and opening up my revisions for the planner that I'm creating. So I just sent over this um, monthly spread to Emma, who's my designer. So sometimes I'll do a combination of freehanding on my iPad and making like layouts in Keynote. So like I created like this little layout thing and then I'll like really edit it up and send it to Emma of like what I want here. Like I'm not very good all the time at like creating things in my head so that's why i have like emma to help me with that stuff and she does an amazing job at like bringing my ideas to life so like here i couldn't really think of like how to create this on the computer but i could like kind of draw it out so i'll do it here um so yeah this is like the monthly overview and then the monthly content calendar and the monthly budget and this is based directly off the episode that i posted um a couple weeks back on manifest which is tori simone about how i budget um, my money. This is exactly the method that I use and I think it's really simple and not intimidating. So I put it in this planner. Um, I kind of want this to be in like a chart or a lined page format. So I'm giving Emma like very creative freedom here of what she wants, but as long as it includes like this stuff, I'm happy. And then um, like a tracker. Oh, I forgot to add a title there, but I'll tell her to do that. Like a budget tracker of um, like date, deposit or withdraw how much and where the money was spent with lots of columns to fill in.
That was such a great recording. I'm in the best mood ever because of it. Happy Tuesday, guys. Today we have a great day on deck. Um, I'm just doing a lot of stuff for Stride today. Pretty much everything today is Stride today. Um, I need to rework our schedule a little bit. Now that it's fall, typically we redo our schedule. Um, so I'm gonna rework that a little bit today. I also sent out a survey to our clients to see what they want. So I got really awesome feedback for that. So I'm gonna use that to help create a um, fall schedule. I have a couple calls later today. I have to make my playlist for tonight because I'm teaching tonight at six. So now I just drink my shake and get to work. Um, let me just double check what I'm definitely doing today. So my apartment complex called me and they gave me a time to move in and I'm so excited. I actually passed a moving truck and I want to see if they can move me um, instead of getting like a U-Haul and everything. I already have a U-Haul, but if they can do it, I'm probably just going to... What were they saying? What am I talking about? This is why I can't multitask. I'm going to see if they can move me. Good morning. Moving into storage. Hi, um, I am moving on Sunday. It's super late notice, but I was wondering if you had anyone available. We don't do Sundays, but we are completely booked. Okay, all right, thank you. You're welcome. Bye. Just as I figured. And why don't people do Sundays? I don't get it. So since I'm teaching tonight, oh, I should probably go flip my laundry. Oh, I hate doing that. I'm back again and I'm on a freaking roll. It's because I had coffee. It really is. I don't always have coffee, but when I do, I get on a freaking roll. I just hired two movers, absurdly expensive. It was $600 for two movers, literally, like for three hours. I feel like that's insanely expensive. But anyway, all the reviews said that they were awesome and that they were really quick. So I reserved them for three hours and I'm so excited to move in and just get everything done. I'm so excited. But now I'm gonna make my playlist. I get so distracted so easily. It's 11.30 right now. Did you make a list of everything you need, like dishes, towels? Yes, I'm going shopping. The vibe that I really wanna go for is just like super calming. Not really super calming, but like last Monday I taught now I was like so like hyper and like ah! And I like got home and I felt horrible after. I was just like, I like went too hard. So today I'm gonna go just like very vibey for class and I'm very excited. So I got the playlist like 80% done. There are so many noises in this house. It always sounds like someone is literally knocking on the door. Wait, what was I saying? This happens all the time to me. I'm, I need to stop. Um, anyway, playlist is like 80% done. I'm kind of starting to hit a little bit of a wall, so I'm gonna go take a break. I think I'm gonna make um, some lunch. I don't know what I want. Um, well, actually I do, but I just have to see if it's here. I really want like chicken and rice cakes and carrots and hummus. All right, so there is chicken breast in the can. Okay, freaking yum. I'm about to make the best lunch ever. I'm so excited. Here's what we're working with. There aren't rice cakes, but there are Triscuits, and this is the best combo ever. 
canned chicken. <laughs> it's like, yeah, we all know this looks gross, but it's really good. Canned chicken made with mayonnaise. I like to also put like buffalo sauce on it, but I couldn't find any. So I'm just gonna do mayonnaise, a little bit. Triscuits, and then on the individual Triscuit, you put a little bit of American cheese on it, and then the chicken. Oh my God, it is so good. You guys have to do it. And there's this caramelized onion hummus from Wegmans, which is the best hummus ever. And I'm gonna cut up the red bell pepper that I got yesterday. This is about to be the best lunch I've ever had. I'm so excited. Okay, this looks horrendous, but I can promise you it's gonna be out of this world incredible. You guys, I'm in the best mood ever. I cannot wait to teach. Um, last I talked to you was right after lunch, um, before all my calls, so now it's five. Um, I've been on calls all afternoon. It's been the best afternoon ever. I'm so like alive and like invigorated right now. I just feel so good. Um, I'm so excited. It was just a great, great, great day of lots of like potential and exciting things that I am so happy about and just so excited for so 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 excited for now i'm packing up to go to the studio um i teach in 30 minutes no i teach in an hour not 30 minutes i'm literally losing my mind um all of my clothes are in storage and i had one shirt that i wanted to wear and it was wet when i took it out of the dryer so i can't wear it so i'm literally like half dressed which people wear sports bras all the time to work out but i don't know lately i've been like wanting to wear tops but I'll wear a sports bra um so yeah same jacket as before just to wear to the studio my sports bra is lululemon my pants are lululemon these are the power through pants and i have to say they're my new fave lululemon pant um, they just look so good. I saw a girl post them in a TikTok, and they look so good. The, one of the big reasons out that I love them is because the back is super high-waisted too. So it carves your body in the most flattering way, and it just hits it in like the best points ever. So, and they stay up, and they are sweat wicking. This is not sponsored, but I love Lululemon, as you guys know, so... Yeah, they're sweat wicking too so like my sweat doesn't like sit in them it pretty much just like dissolves i don't know how it works i'm gonna refill my water what time is it 509 oh emma just sent me the next edit for the planners this looks awesome really really good all right let's go Honestly, the more that I look at my hair, the more I think that there is like curly hair trying to escape. Like, I think my hair has some natural wave and curl to it, which wouldn't be weird or out of the ordinary because my mom and my sister have naturally really curly hair. Like, my hair is a literal mess right now because I didn't um, wash my hair after spin, so it was like kind of wet when I went to sleep. I don't know. Like, don't you think it looks like there's just some like waves trying to get out of it? I'm about to brush my hair, which, you know, they say if you have curly hair, you're not supposed to do. But the reason why I think, sorry, anyone cringing while I brush my hair. I always cringe when people brush their hair. Um, the only reason I think that I might have it is because when I brush my hair like this, and then I give it like an hour to go back to normal, it comes back with waves in it. I kind of feel like the older I get, the wavier. It's just been like getting throughout the, throughout the years of my life. Today is Wednesday, my friends. Happy Wednesday. It's a beautiful, 
beautiful Wednesday here. Let's see, I've been looking forward to today, this whole week, because today we get to go shopping um, for my new apartment. So we get to go everywhere. I have to make my shopping list, but I am so excited for today. Um, there are a couple work things that I need to do from yesterday that rolled over into today. So I'm gonna do that right now and then we'll make our list and go shopping very soon. I'm so excited. So Strat has a bunch of promotions right now. That's a lot of what I was working on yesterday. So today I'm working on the marketing for it. So right now I am creating a newsletter for Stride. I always use Canva. Um, it's literally the best. So yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. Pretty good deals, if I do say so myself. $24 for seven days of unlimited classes and free weekday childcare. Pretty awesome. Okay, let's talk through this because now I need to update everything for um, for Scott. Yeah. Um, All right, well then let's rework this really quick. So. Like in that back bathroom, that bathroom's so big. We might yeah, we could definitely put something in there. Shove a washer dryer in there. All right, see what I mean? Now it's like, it gets wavy again. I don't know where the day has gone, but it's noon. Um, so I'm gonna eat something and then make my list and then we're gonna go shopping. So it's 2.30 now. I don't know where today is going. It's literally flying by. And I think I ordered new shoes a couple of days ago and I think they're coming today, which is so exciting if they do. I'd love it if they did. So if they do, I am definitely gonna wear them when I go on my little errands. I've been doing a lot of online shopping the last two and a half hours. And guys, it's so, it's just like so expensive and I just don't wanna buy it. You know that feeling where you're just kinda like, I'm just gonna let this marinate in the card for a little bit. That's where I've been for the last like 10 minutes. I actually just got off the phone with my um, lawyer. I had to talk to him about something for um, the business, but yeah, I, after I was like, okay, when I get off the with him, like then I'm gonna make my decisions. I don't know, like I have some really cute stuff. Like I have a coffee table book, I have a jewelry organizer. Um, I guess I don't need that, we can delete that. Um, I have trash bags, which I can, I can get those later, Tori. CB2 is just so expensive. And for what, they don't even have literally anything in stock they're like yeah it'll ship in like maybe january that hurts so bad so i ended up lowering everything a little bit um i took out the chairs from wayfair because they were just too expensive and i can find other ones that i like and i think once i'm there and i can like see the space it'll be better i didn't get anything from ikea i think i just need to go into the store because i chose delivery and it said nothing is available for delivery so i have to go to the store i unpopular opinion hate going to the ikea store because it takes so long because you have to walk through the stupid showroom and see everything you can't just like walk in to like where you go pick up the stuff they just like they don't let you so i hate doing that cb2 hurts to purchase from why did i get three things and why was it almost 300 dollars? i cut it down from five to three that's good for me but like that really hurt me all of that and now i feel like i barely even bought anything like i got lamp i got sconces i got rugs but i don't have like a coffee table i don't have curtains i don't know if i'm having fun doing all this it's always you know fun in theory but then you like do it and you're like oh my god I bet you guys are really tired of seeing me just in my house, but I'm leaving the house today. Um, I ended up not even going to the stores yesterday because I did a ton of online shopping. And by the time, like I even bought more stuff when I um, last vlogged. But as soon as I was done that, I was like, okay, I don't want to spend any more money today. So I put a freeze on myself and I'm going to go today to Target, Costco, Home Depot. I'd like to go to like Kirkland's or Home Goods, one of the two, um, because also tonight we are decorating at the studio. So I'll bring you guys along for that. That'll be fun. We have Oktoberfest this upcoming weekend, October 1st, 2nd, and 3rd. 
So that will be really fun. But it's already Thursday and I'm so happy that it's already Thursday because I'm just one day closer to moving into my apartment and having my own space. I am just so excited. This morning, um, what are we gonna do this morning? I'm going to, I think, make that like coffee smoothie shake that I made the other day. Um, and then I'm going to record and edit um, my podcast and send that off. I wanna do another round of planner edits, but I also just wanna kinda like get going because I know myself and I know if I procrastinate going shopping, that I'll just continue to procrastinate and won't do it. So I'm gonna kinda give myself like a 10 a.m. Like you gotta be out the door at 10 a.m. It's 8 a.m. right now. This is not a crisis line, it's not self-help. It is professional counseling done securely online. You can send a message to your counselor at any time. Everything, no. Um, so, <laughs> yes, yes, so cute. And you mentioned, mentioned the design, design of, them. of them. You, my moving vlog where I like move into my apartment and stuff. And then I have really fun videos planned, like waking up at 5 a.m. for a week and cooking my own meals at home. Sunday resets, like very productive videos that I just want to bring value to someone's life. All right, it's 10 a.m. So I'm gonna stick to my goal and get out of my house. If I ever get invited to Fashion Week, just know that it was a pity invite. Who would get invited to Fashion Week looking like this? Not me. This is just a stride zip up, Lululemon shorts, and I'm wearing snooks. Guys, look, I left my house. I'm in the car. Aren't you proud of me? This was exactly what I was looking at yesterday at CB2, but it was like, hundred dollars there and it's 35 here at target i think i'm gonna get this i'm kind of killing it right now i got tablecloths table runner kitchen towels i'm like doing really good very successful all right not gonna lie i killed it um i did so good i didn't check that much off my list but i got a lot of things that i needed that i forgot to write on my list Oh my God, literally everyone is here. Um, everyone is here. I've seen someone from every single studio in our area here today, so fun. Uh, I did great. I'm gonna go to Home Depot right now, which I don't even know where Home Depot is. I think there's one by Chick-fil-A. I absolutely cannot vlog in Home Depot. Nope, I wanna be in and out of there as fast as humanly possible. I hate going to Home Depot. Um, it's noon. I got Chick-fil-A, Arnold Palmer. Mm -mm. Um, I'm going to watch Salt Lake City Housewives um, for a little bit. And then I'm probably going to sand the furniture. And then my mom should be home around then. And then we're going to Costco. All right, let me show you the pieces that I'm painting. Well, first off, this is the garage. Most of this stuff is being moved, but not all of it, but a pretty good amount of it. So... This is the chest that I'm painting. Um, the color definitely works now, but I just want it black. So I'm painting this black, and then the legs of this table I'm gonna paint black too. Not every part, you're not gonna get it every part, but you should have. Modern CEO has a good tactical plan for how to make things work. Okay, this is how much I got done. It's looking like pretty good, I think, but it's just a lot of work. Then I have to do that side and all of that side. It's just boring, to be honest. Um, but my mom and I are gonna head out right now to Costco and... Is there anywhere else you wanna go? Do you wanna go to Kirkland's? Mom? What? Did you wanna go, do you wanna go to like Kirkland's or anything too? Well, if we go, say hi, mom. Hey. Well, if we go to the Costco by Kirkland's, we could do that. I don't like that. They didn't have anything like furniture wise. Yeah, you're I right. I like the other Costco better. All right, let's go to that one then. Well, let's start with Costco. If we want to go to Kirkland's, we can. Okay. What else do you need at Costco? Um, no, I need stuff at Costco. I need to get an air fryer. She can't even hear me. She walks out. Okay, I need to get an air fryer. I need pots and pans. Um, I wanna look if they have outdoor balcony furniture, like two chairs and like an outdoor rug and a small table maybe. 
Probably if not, not this time of year. If not, maybe I'll just steal yours. No. I'm just kidding. Um, I need, I feel like they would this time of year. It's on sale probably. Yeah, and they'll like, have Christmas trees in there already. Oh. <laughs> um, I need, oh, I need curtains and a curtain rod, but I don't need to get that like right now because the place, com it comes with blinds. It has those shades, yeah. So I can not get those bedroom, later. Though. I think just in the living room. No, it comes in the bedroom too. Oh, good. Okay. I would like a shower caddy. Yeah. Or like a shower bench, like the one that you have in your shower. Do you, re did you in your video, do you know how the faucet is? Like, is there room to hang one over a faucet? Or uh, let me look. A, like a suction cup thingy? Just so it's not like in the spray of the... Yeah. I hate that one. Oh, it's so cute in there. <laughs> yeah, and then these are the shades. I hope you love it there, for Me too. Oh, and I got sconces. Oh, you did? From Wayfair, yeah. So my mom and I are at Restoration Hardware, and we found options for my table. So we like this. But do they have more of these, or is it just this one? I don't, I don't know. Oh, we are so dangerous when it comes to Restoration Hardware. We literally, we're, um, Two hundred twenty-three. That's pretty good. This is really cute too. I know, and there's two of them, so I could get two and then just order two more. Do you want me to bring one down? Yeah. Do you need help? Oh, that looks so cute. Okay, guys. So now I put this chair up. That looks really good too. And that's like a vibe, you know? I just spent so much money. <laughs> but we did it. We went with the black table and three, no, four of the um, wheelie chairs. And, you know, I think it was good because the bar stools I got looked like the chairs, the other chairs that I wanted, but they were only three total of them, which can't work. And they were three hours away, which I don't have time for a six hour road trip. No. So anyway, but now I have to go back to Target and exchange some of the stuff that I got because like I got black place settings because I was assuming it was gonna be on my white table but now it's on a black table. So I'm gonna get, I'm thinking like woven, like tan with like maybe some throw pillows on some of those chairs and like a tan blanket. Won't that be pretty? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you definitely need some earthy tones in there to, yeah. to warm it up. Yeah, plants. Cause now the only thing we need left is a coffee table. So as you guys know, yesterday I ran out of Triscuits. So I'm hoping my grandma has some. Cause we forgot to get them. No, she doesn't. It's okay. She always does. Except this time. Yeah, we have this little kitchen upstairs for my grandma, which I don't think I've ever showed. She's so cute. All right guys, I'm gonna head to the studio and drop off a couple things for this weekend, for Oktoberfest that starts tomorrow. Guys, I just got my makeup done. Bye Alexa. Hi. What's your Instagram? I'll put it on the screen. Aesthetics by Alexa. Perfect, go follow her if you're in the Philly area. Love you. Um, so I have the wedding today, as you guys know, and all my makeup is back. So I DM'd Alexa like last week on Instagram. I was like, I know it's so last minute, but is there <laughs> any chance? She's like, oh my God, of course. So she came to my house, was the best. Yes, love it's you. It's so cute. Love you. <laughs> I love it. And it was my first time ever getting my makeup oh, done yeah. too. Like ever. I and I love it. I did it. I bought this table, black table, that I showed yesterday from Restoration Hardware Outlet, and um, it's saran wrapped right now, but it's black. You can kind of see it on the legs. Really, really cute. And then I got four of these like rolling chairs to go with it, since this will double as like my office table and dining table. I wanted the chairs to be super comfy, so we picked that up 
just now, um, but I forgot my camera, so I didn't literally vlog nothing. But I picked it up with my wedding makeup done. So it was super glam pickup for me. Um, but I'm gonna start like doing my hair. All I'm gonna do is straighten it because I, well, I ordered a dress on. Friday, no, I ordered a dress last week and it was supposed to come in today, but it's not coming until Monday now. So Brandy dropped off a green dress for me. Oh, hi Ringo. Oh, mom, when did you come inside? What? I didn't even hear you come inside. Um, so Brandy dropped off a green dress for me. So I'm gonna wear that and straighten my hair. I have to melt it. It's the cutest thing. What is it called, a butter pot? I don't know what it is, but that's what I mom always used it for. Oh my God, it's so cute. Tell the people what you're making. Butternut squash ravioli. From TJ's, Trader Joe's. Yeah, Trader Joe's, and I'm doing a brown butter sage sauce. I mean, not sauce, just brown butter. Just put it over top of it. Perfect. I feel like today I've been getting ready all day like literally running around all day thank god alexa did my makeup because all of my makeup is packed like i said so i don't have any of it in fact i haven't even washed my hair because my good hair products are at the beach i'm wearing this like long sleeve like forest green dress which is perfect because it's october 1st today so, I wanted to do, and it has like long sleeves. I guess I said that. But I wanted to do, maybe I put this here instead. I wanted to do long, straight hair. All right, this is the dress. It looks black um, on camera, but um, just trust me that it's green. Um, so yeah, Alexa, again, did my makeup. It looks so good. I straighten my hair, but my front pieces always get like bent just from existing and I don't know how. My hair also looks so dry because, well, I haven't washed it in a while and I don't really have my products that I normally use right now. So I feel like my hair isn't the best and I don't know, it's like already getting kind of like wavy again on me, but uh, my shoes are just nude that I had at the beach that I packed when I was down last weekend. Um, they're from Amazon. My bag, I didn't bring my bag with me, but it's just going to be a black um, Gucci bag that I have, but honestly, any bag would work. Um, but yeah, I am ready to go.